When I first won the Masayuki Tokioka Award, the first thing I thought of was, my gosh, what we can do with the money to support our school and our children. And so it, it got me truly excited. What I did first of all was send out an email to all of my staff. And it was really nice because the feedback that I received was from a teacher, Mr. Bob Underwood, who felt that a solar project would be perfect. So my involvement in pursuing the award started with a discussion I had with Mrs. Espiritu about Thomas Friedman's book, The World is Flat. And in that book, he outlines a plan to start renewable energy in the United States. And our whole staff was on board with that. As a faculty member, I was really excited because quite honestly, I've heard a lot about being green, but I didn't really know um, in depth what that meant. So the solar project was exciting for me because I think I also learned and grew as a teacher. The panels are located on Building I. We house our third and second grade classes in there. The solar project benefits the school and the students not only because we can you know save money by using our solar energy but it's a really good teaching tool in different classes because you can really take this one project and move into different areas of conservation. It makes me feel happy because I feel like we're helping contribute to making our world a better place because we're putting less pollution into the air. We wouldn't have ordinarily had this project because it wouldn't have been funded and the funding that has, has come in has hence made this available for the students to learn from. The best thing is that it saves money because they have to pay the electric bill, but with the solar panels, it's not as high. It'll just save money and maybe they can buy extra things for the school. The solar project was kind of the catalyst or the seed, if you will, that initiated STEM projects for our Kanaka Kai School students. So the solar panel project really is like a first step to our Going Green initiative at our school. After we got the solar panel projects, we had enough money to create a greenhouse. And we also did a CFL project with Blue Planet. So what the kids decided to do is they wanted to actually make an impact right now. Is there any way we can switch out every single incandescent light bulb in every home on Molokai. It turned into something truly fabulous, a total community effort. So then at the end of the project, I think about 36,000 light bulbs were exchanged. I know our surveys kind of show that about 96% of households switched over from incandescents to CFLs. The project actually saved the community $6.5 million over the lifetime of the light bulb. So that's all money that's going to go back in to our Molokai economy. The best thing about the solar panel project, I think, was many hands, many minds, and many hearts working together as one, partnering with community, our parents, our students, you know, we're just cohesively working together. Finding new ways to teach our children how to use our natural resources in the best possible way. I'm very blessed to have been selected. I really will continue the work. I will also hopefully be an inspiration to others. And thank you, Island Insurance Foundation, for giving me that opportunity. And on behalf of Kaunakakai Elementary School, we really thank you from, from our heart. Thank you.